is going to have to help out. They do. And now here they come. Uh, Boston's making a late change with their D. They don't have good gap, but Jensen will uh, bring it into his backhand. Shot right on, and Emmerich uh, juggled it. Now they'll try and wrap it around. They center right out to Mulherin. The shot, they score! Mulherin on the power play. It hit a body in front, but it's good enough to win Minnesota the game. And they celebrate as they will win this hockey game. Two to one, and will stay undefeated. As the other way, Morin moving up. Morin going wide on Schottler. Morin back to the middle, scores! Montreal wins it in double overtime as the puck squirts free to Quinn Beauchene. And that's a huge goal for the ice score as they roar all the way back to win it in double OT. for Saskatchewan. The first overtime period. Last minute of play in the first overtime period. Here's a breakaway. Number 19, Donovan. Donovan going in, shoots, goes! <laughs> Junior Rangers goal. Scored by number 19, Alexander Donovan. Unassisted, top of the goal, 41 seconds. That's Donovan unassisted at 41 seconds. Fleece wins the puck. Here's Fleece. He's got a step. He scores! Mason Fleece! Team California goal, scored by number 11, Mason Fleece, unassisted. Time in the goal of one minute, 22 seconds. And Bell's gonna push it through uh, as he goes one-on-one, -on -one, he lets the wrister go, and Hamilton, uh, so Saskatchewan goes one forward, one D. Boston goes two forwards as Bell gets that big frame out, he protects it. He's got Monroe going to the net, he centers, they score! Monroe! Stuck in back door and he puts it home as Boston will jump off the bench and they celebrate right in front of the Pats bench. The Boston Junior Bruins winning goal in double overtime, scored by number 94, Michael Monroe. Gagnon will line it up on the inside because of what it right to where he was, but he ended up uh, Getting it back to the point. Now Evans will give it to McCausland. He walks off the wall, spins it back to Evans. Evans has daylight, but he had it uh, spin off his stick. Now back door, they score! Evans found McCausland on the back door and he deflected it home. And Boston caps it off as they win it 6 5 in double overtime. The Boston Junior Bruins goal, the overtime goal, goes to number nine. Cosland. Looking up, quickly stolen away from him though by Mooney. Mooney, stretch pass for McKenzie. Here's a breakaway. McKenzie coming in, shooting, and that one is stopped by Byers. Mooney, and he'll move in again. Mooney across from McKenzie, and it's wide of the net. Mooney, the wraparound, no goal, scores! It was waved off, but it is now ruled good. Mooney wins it for Pennsylvania, 3-2 in double overtime. The game-winning goal for Team Pennsylvania was scored by number 19, Charlie Trethaway, with an assist from number 28, Quinn McKenzie. From there on, so now uh, Toronto will work its way into the BC zone. Who's gonna get the gold goal here to win the championship? As it reminds me of the Hawks and the Mighty Ducks. Didn't quite make it to overtime, but the Ducks won it with no time left on the clock. As now the shot through, it's a fight. They rebound, they score! There's the gold goal as number, I thought it was number 91 yeah. that scored it. 
as it uh, was Owen Griffin at the side of the goal. And nobody really cared after that. They went to ball goaltender. Number 31, Jack Avokovic in Toronto will celebrate and steal the championship away from the BC Junior Canucks. Wow. Just 33 seconds into overtime, Owen Griffin at the side of the net pops the game winner.